He has delighted millions of soccer fans the world over. And he is unique, that in the even abroad, in Germany, Yugoslavia, Holland, Belgium, France, Sweden, and Italy, he has at some time or another been voted the most popular figure in modern football. And, and I have telegrams from this, these various countries here tonight, which will be read later to you, further testifying to respect. <laughs> and gentlemen, he is still, maybe I shouldn't use the word still, he is a great athlete at 41 years of age. Again, that can only signify one thing, strength of will, character, and purpose. He started playing football at 15 for Stoke City, and at 41, his pace, ability, stamina, and skill are still very much undiminished. At times, in fact, the better in the world then. So standing back to the Well, may I welcome you as you join the members of the National Sporting Club here at their headquarters in the Cafe Royal, where tonight they're paying tribute to Stanley Matthews, probably one of the greatest footballers of all time. He has spent we are as master football and great sportsmen. Good health, Stanley, says the Blackpool manager, George Smith. Good health and long may the family earth caught there, so they must have been just on their way home after their match on Saturday. They say proud of the national football team of Russia, send congratulations to Stanley on the occasion of his brilliant jubilee. We wish you good health and good luck in life. privilege to be allowed to come here to pay homage to a man who is undoubtedly a genius. Yeah, yeah. I mean that in every sense of the word when I refer to Stanley Matthews. Yeah. I remember Stanley Matthews when I was a boy. <laughs> to the Under Secretary for Home Affairs, I've got guts. <laughs> it's only because they have a body hanging, I dare say. It. As I stand here and look around, apart from our great Stanley Matthews, the other great footballers, it looks like an annual dinner of Fulham Football Club. <laughs> for a moment, I thought I was in the wrong channel. I looked across at the other table, I saw sitting together four shades of hair with Bert Trotman, Mike Hawthorne, Jimmy C. Travelling around in any part of the world, whether they speak English or not, if they understand football, and they do in most countries better than we do, <laughs> they all know Matthews. I must say that he has helped uh, our country politically, and I tell you this is a true story. During the time when the Russian Dynamos first made their visit to White Hart Lane, uh, they played the Arsenal, which included, of course, Stanley Matthews, <laughs> Joe Bacuzzi of Fulham, <laughs> Ronnie Wook of Fulham. Excited, in his anxiety to get the ball, grabbed Stanley by the wrist and literally pulled him off. When a fellow sitting in front of me in the stand said, that settles it. At the next election, I'll vote Conservative. <laughs> On a final attempt, I'm hoping that eventually when he retires from football, he'll go to Wimbledon as an amateur and make a fortune. <laughs> This token, this token I regard, and knowing full well the world, I'm sure, I'm sure that although you may not be a
Right, ladies and gentlemen, I feel somehow I'm going to lose my reputation tonight. <laughs> You've heard Tommy Trinder. He's a comedian. He's a director of football, film football club. I feel out of place as fun would be if they're in the first division. <laughs> Come to think of it, if Fulham did ever get to the first division, that would be Tommy Chandler's wildest dream. <laughs> Stoke City. I never dreamt then that someday I'd have to stand on my feet and make a speech to a room full of the most famous names in British sport. As you can gather by the menu, my father was a boxer. He used to tell me about the, his fights at Royal National Sporting concerned about helped to make this an evening which I shall never forget as long as I live. I thank you very sincerely. You know, sometimes I'm called the man of soccer. I am a little thin on top, <laughs> but really I'm not that old. I sometimes envy the people who saw the great stars such as Jimmy Seed, Steve Bloomer, Billy Meredith, Joe Smith, Charlie Bokum, and a few others. Mind you, since my time, and up to the present time, I've played with great players, with and against. There's Joe Morrison, Eddie Hapgood, Freddie Steele, Stan Morrison, Harry Johnston, Sam Bartram, Bill Trotten, Frank Swift, and they were really great players. And also, I like to pay tribute to the pleasant players, too. There's Tommy Finney, great player. Billy Wright, another great player. There's so many others. And I feel sure that this, there is a lot of good young players, such as Edwards, Haynes. I have to mention him because of Frank and Tommy Tony had to mention <laughs> Without a doubt, I feel sure that it would be all right for England to come and be on top of the world in the football world. I'd like to thank you for the wonderful present you have presented me. My lords and gentlemen, I thank you. <laughs>